everybody. So we're on our way to meet uh, a gentleman that has started wholesaling and wants to get into a little bit of a hold, buy and holds uh, using the Burr method. <clears throat> For those of you that don't know what the Burr method is, it is to buy, rehab, rent, refinance, and then re rinse and repeat basically. So, you know, you're taking a little bit of your money or maybe everybody else's money, other people's money, and buying a property to rehab it, getting it rented, turning around, trying to get all the cash back out of it, pay everybody off, and then creating cash flow for yourself. What are you doing right now? So what I'm doing right now is uh, he's got a house that he wants to talk about because he wants to see if he can make this work and he wants to understand it. So I'm doing some pre-research on the way over there for the house to see what the comps are for the house. Um, it's in an area of uh, Jacksonville that is the the values of the homes are you know a hundred thousand or under so I want to make sure that the values there to be able to go get it refinanced and actually get a loan on a minimum loan because most hard money lenders have a minimum loan amount so I'm, I'm trying to make sure that a you know that value could be there and B, that the rent comps support what he's trying to do as well. So I'm trying to educate myself a little bit on his particular house. So when I go talk to him, you know, I could talk a little bit about that as well, as well as look at the house and look at what needs to be done from a rent rehab perspective. So what tools are you using to, to do this research? That's a great question. So um, I'm a licensed realtor. So I am using the MLS to do some of this research. Um, I'm using Zillow to look at pictures. Uh, I'm going to be using Rentometer uh, to, to look at rents. So I, I'll look at a couple different places. So I'm going to I'm going to look up values in our MLS. I'm going to look up values in Zillow for both the ARV, the future value of this property, as well as rents, what the rents are, are renting for, and um, and then. Uh, I'm also looking at some of the lenders that we actually know about that actually do this type of work, uh, refinancing work on on investment property. And I'm trying to see which lender has a minimum loan amount that they could that he could go down to about fifty thousand on. So the whole goal is is that he's got to get it to a value that then he can um, refinance it and his loan. His loan's probably going to be around fifty, sixty thousand dollars. Turn right after so he needs a loan that actually will have uh, or allow a minimum loan that's small. Not every lender will, so that's one of the key things that you need to understand. So I'm just kind of, you know, doing some of that research to to prep and um, go meet with him and share some insight with him and help him out as he's progressing right on his after journey. A quarter he's just of a starting mile out onto and uh, hopefully I can be some help for him. So that's what we're, we're up to today. See you later.